What have you done for me lately? That should be the theme of the starting pitchers that you look at as you evaluate them down the stretch of August and September. And very true today. I got a pick today that I'm going to get to to you in uh, one second here that uh, definitely speaks to that as we dig into the numbers. Hey everyone, it's Five Farley. It's August 28th and uh, we are right down the stretch. Sorry for a late video. I've been in a meeting all day. You can see I'm traveling. Um, I, I just got out, so I wanted to get this video pick out to you. And check out my other picks down in the comments um, that seem to be working well. I appreciate the feedback yesterday from everyone who uh, chimed in. Um, first, though, let me say thanks to the subscribers. I appreciate it. Welcome to the new subscribers. Second, let me say yesterday, another win on uh, Houston Astros. That is, I think, nine or ten straight wins. Um, and the majority, I looked at it, 17 of the last 20 games are wins. Nine of the 20 picks are underdogs. How is that for a record? Um, all right, let's get into today. What have you done for me lately? Speaking of, here we go. Um, looking at today's game, I got the Milwaukee Brewers going to um, Cincinnati Reds. I don't have the Brewers. I have the Reds. Uh, Milwaukee's traveling to uh, Cincinnati. Cincinnati here is... Um, uh, lost five straight. I'm looking for them to get back on the winning track. Uh, Brewers looking for a playoff spot. Um, so they are still in the hunt. Uh, they got Junior Guerra on the mound going against Anthony DiSclafini. Uh, DiSclafini has been pitching very well as of late. Check out his numbers. Uh, going six, seven, and two thirds, seven and seven, averaging about seven innings per start in his last four. Uh, going three and one. Overall, going four of his last five, getting wins. Um, giving up uh, four at Chicago. I'll give him a hall pass there. Went six innings, eight hits, four earned runs. I'll give him a hall pass on that one. Then against San Francisco, six hits, one run. Arizona at home, three hits, zero runs. At Washington, six hits, one run. And then before that, Philadelphia, five hits, three runs, and four and a third, a little rougher there. Um, but like I said, winning four of the five. Um, I'm going to take him at home because I'm going to flip over now to Junior Guerra. Junior Guerra he started the season fantastic. Check out his ERA in each month through the season. April, 0.82 ERA. May, 3.9. June, 3.8. July, 4.68. August, 5.09. Each month going up and up. Same as reflective in opponent's batting average. Starting at a 176 batting average in April, going up and up and up all the way to August, a 337 batting average for opponents in August. His last 30 days, a 6.0 ERA. 27 innings, 37 hits, opponents hitting 336, like I mentioned, in his last five starts. On the road, a 5.76 ERA. Not a lot to like there. Opponents hitting 292 on the road. So give me the underdog of the Cincinnati Reds at home. Get them at about a plus 110 right now. Um, check out my other picks down below. I'm going to get this po video posted as quickly as I possibly can. Good luck, everyone. I'll see you again soon.